This is a live look at Moosehead Lake this morning, a dreary Sunday morning in Mallory. I'm not a big coffee drinker, <laughs> but if I was, this would definitely be a two or maybe even a three cup morning. <laughs> Yeah, yesterday at least was for me. Mine's right over there, so it's waiting for me. And yeah, it's a hard morning to get up and out of, and it's not going to get better. I think tomorrow's probably worse because it's Monday and it will still be a little bit rainy. But the rain is much needed. We are starting to get in a really minor drought situation. And every year it seems like we get this little bit of June gloom. It's this rainy and dreary couple few days that we have to get through at some point in the month. And at least we're getting it out of the system early on. So the rain is actually going to become a bit more widespread during the day today. We'll get a break into Monday and more so late morning into the afternoon. We'll start to see scattered showers. There'll be few and far between that will linger into Tuesday afternoon before it becomes a bit more aggressive again in the widespread nature of the shower activity and then by Thursday we start to see some moments of sunshine so it'll be a little bit better we just gotta get through a couple days of this really good for the gardens really good to get things saturated again and pretty much eliminate that minor drought situation that was starting to to come together here in a lot of the northeast so very gloomy start to the day today we are expecting those temperatures to hover into the 40s might just get to 50 degrees depending on how much rain does come through certain areas will probably stay between 45 and 50 all around north wind still bringing a blustery feel out there it is going to create a wind chill factor and i actually have that map today so <laughs> it is june we're talking wind chill not much rain since midnight most of that has been focused down east because the precipitation is actually coming in from the east it's circling around that low which we'll see in our uh, future cast in just a few moments. But we can also see that here in the radar. It's a bit more focused into the eastern part of the state, swinging into the western part of the state. That will continue throughout most of the day today. In the broad range, it's really just Maine and New Hampshire feeling the effects of this particular system, and of course to our east in Nova Scotia. Current temperatures mostly into the low, 30, low 40s, a couple 30s out there as well, and yep, wind chill map. We are feeling like we're in the 30s in most areas when you factor in that blustery north and northeast wind. So here we go. We get that rain just circling in. It will come in somewhat of a band formation. And where it starts to come in, it will kind of hang there through much of the day. Especially by tonight, it will become very consistent. You'll hear the downpours. You'll hear the rain pitter-pattering on your window. Tough Monday morning. Get the coffee, tea, whatever you want to help you get up tomorrow morning. Uh, you should prep it tonight. It's going to be a dreary Monday. We do start to see that break into the afternoon, as I mentioned, and we'll see that actually into a bit of Tuesday before those showers do start to rotate back in. And we will see some pockets start to break out of sunshine. See those temperatures actually getting into the 60s in some areas. So I'd say Monday is the last day of that true cloud cover kind of hanging around. So showers tonight, breezy. The coolness is sticking with us as well. Of course, on the water, we're dealing with that gale warning and seas are going to be elevated as well as that wind flow. All right, next seven days, there is that light at the end of the four forecast it comes in later on Thursday and Friday is really going to be scattered in nature for showers, but we still can't rule them out. But by next Saturday, we're so close. We're getting there. <laughs> Already looking to next weekend, we'll start to bring in some dry days and more sunshine.